um, and the significance of this day not lost on anyone. In the NBA with a full slate, 20 games, or 20 teams playing, 10 games on the day on, uh, on a very special day. See what? It is a very special day, and you just said it doesn't happen through inevitability, and I think that's important to remember because he put the effort in. In other words, you can continue to have a dream, you can continue to have a goal, but unless you keep working for it, unless you keep striving, it's not going to happen. So to those out there that continue to help others, you know, thank you and continue, but you have to continue working to fulfill his dream. Uh, and I want to thank the NBA for making this a big deal. You know, us it's three... In fact, dream big is, yeah, their, is their slogan but, for the but, day. But us three guys... We live in the dream. <clears throat> We're living the dream. We've been so fortunate and blessed. If we would have been born at a different time, our lives would be totally different. I mean, our lives would be totally different if we were much older. And I think Dr. King, Bill Russell, uh, Mega Evers, uh, Rosa Parks, I mean, th the list goes on and on. We're so lucky and blessed that they did, I always say, they did the heavy lifting. They did the heavy lifting. And I... I can never, Jackie Robinson, I'll never want to miss him. Jim Brown, those guys. I just want to say thank you to those guys for making it possible for us to live our dream. Because we have been born at a different time, Ernie, our life would be totally different. And to add on what Chuck says, uh, you know, I just love what he stood for. Stood for peace, stood for tranquility, he stood for family. You know, a, a lot of his speech has been made into quotes. You know, he's a very, very quotation individual. One of my favorite quotes is, if you can't fly, then run. Can't run, then walk. If you can't walk, then crawl. But whatever you do, you just have to move forward. And I also like to thank all the people that you know. Chuck said, and it's a great day. Kudos to the NBA, and uh, thank you, Dr. King.